Hi everyone, this is Fahad Mirza and I welcome you to the channel. If you have been following my channel, you might have noticed that I have created this new series where I am comparing lot of AI models, lot of AI toolings and frameworks. I already have covered the TTS models and then sub 10 billion models. The comparison is unbiased, it is neutral, it is not favoring any model and the objective here is to give you a guideline so that you could adopt the model as per your own use case. The reason why I have started is because there are thousands of models at the moment now and we already have covered almost all of them on the channel and it's really hard to identify which model is suited for which use case and that is why I have created this new series. I am intending to keep it alive so please also share your thoughts if you want me to do any specific comparison of any category feel free to put it in the comments for the purpose of this video i am going to go with a comparison which is around compact large language model i believe that this comparison is important because there is a growing interest and need for compact efficient ai models that anyone can run on either standard CPU with good memory or consumer grade GPUs or even directly on devices themselves. Such capabilities democratize AI development and allow for wide accessibility for users with different requirements from simple local deployment on laptops or desktops to integrate on small scale cloud servers or edge devices. This is not only cost effective but also enables you to get started with these models so let's dive into a clear tabular comparison first and then i'm also going to explain each one of this comparison as why exactly i have put in the values here most of these values are factual and one thing i want to mention here is that it is not just random selection it is also based on um the fact that I have been covering these models for more than last two years and you can verify it from my channel and I have not only installed them locally I have tested them I have also evaluated them on various benchmarks plus I have implemented most of them for various clients in real world so this is just not theoretical information this is backed up by the last couple of years of experience and as I said all of the models which I'm going to mention here have already been covered on the channel in great detail okay so first up the models which I have selected are Alibaba's coin Google's Gemma Meta's Llama not the recent Llama 4 but a real good model Llama 3.2 and yes surprisingly AMD's Olmo and I have also got Hugging Face small LM2 model there are heaps of other models and I will also be comparing them but I think at the moment in real life from the user's perspectives from the use case perspective these are few of the best models available which are uh, I would say sub 1 billion at the moment. Now we see here clearly all models being compared are small accessible under or around 1 billion parameters and tuned specifically for local deployment conditions. AMD Olmo is noteworthy as it is specifically optimized for AMD GPUs and designed with rigorous fine tuning regimes making it great for high quality reasoning and logical tasks. Meta Llama uses reinforcement learning with human feedback for more aligned responses at natural conversation flow. If you just want to play around uh, have a baby model go with this small LM2 from Hugging Face a real enjoyable model in my opinion. Whereas for I would say um, use cases where you have where you want a quality model but in a with a small footprint go with Gemma 3 billion uh, Gemma 3 1 billion instruct one and I will be talking more about this model and use cases of course. Now if you look at this um, table you can see that there are lot of gen generation capabilities of these models and also some information around context. Llama offers the largest context size of around 128k. This is quite useful when dealing with extensive conversations or stories. Gemma excels in multimodal image and text understanding with extensive multilingual coverage. Quite useful 
for creative and visual applications. Alibaba's coin stands out with structured JSON output capabilities, quite ideal for practical integration and especially where the data is structured. AMD Olmo specifically emphasizes logic, math and coding, adapting well to practical computational tasks despite a moderate context size. Small LM2's capability is smaller, geared towards efficient on-device usage that could be tablet or your mobile. But I believe keeping these capabilities in perspective, it makes it easier to select the model. Now going to this suitability for local deployment metrics, you can see that AMD Olmo is particularly attractive if you are already using AMD hardware as it is optimized specifically for such platforms, potentially greatly improving performance and efficiency. Small LM2 and Quen offer the lowest level of hardware requirement, ideal even for older laptops or embedded devices. Gemma and Llama require moderate systems but comfortably operate on standard consumer grade GPUs and desktop CPUs. So you can also check the RAM and CPU requirement and then go accordingly. And then we have this use case one. Now this is a hard one, but as I said, you everyone has its own unique case. So you have to just think hard, go through this video again, listen to what exactly features uh, I'm talking about these models and then go accordingly. So small LM2 is designed specially for constrained devices and application demanding little power or memory. AMD Olmo excels substantially in math, coding, and logic application scenarios, making it ideal for software developers, coders, and academic users. Gemma is ideal for visual and creative use cases due to multimodal capabilities and also general tasks out there where quality is paramount. And talking about quality, Llama is another highly suitable for business building chatbots or dialogue based applications, whereas Quen works best for structured interactions or chatbot applications in multiple languages, especially bilingual, Chinese and English, and that emphasizes structured data output too in terms of Quen's model. So you see, I'm just going to keep it targeted and definite. All of these lightweight models democratize AI, AI access being deployable on setups most developers already have. By introducing AMD Olmo, we have also further refined our list to strictly sub 1 billion parameter models with not only with NVIDIA, but also with AMD. All of them have excellent local inference capabilities, cleared specialized use cases perfectly suitable where the resources are constrained. And if you are just starting out, so let me know in the comments which sort of model you are using. And before I let you go, I also want to introduce you to the sponsors of the video who are iGenPod. iGenPod lets you effortlessly deploy a personalized knowledge bot across platforms like Discord, Slack, and others. It is ideal for open source tech communities and startups that provide user support. And I will drop the link to their website in video's description. So as I said, let me know please which small LM you are using for your use case, especially for your real world use case. Again, if you want me to do any comparison, feel free to suggest in the comments. If you like the content, please consider subscribing to the channel. If you're already subscribed, please share it among your network as it helps. Thank you for watching.